Hey everybody, so I'm pretty sure if you saw my uh, five mistakes to avoid video, you saw that I broke my FlexCut detail knife on purpose in there. Uh, it snapped off the tip and now I think I'm gonna go ahead and try and see if I can fix it. Um, I'm not gonna use a, a grinder, like, like a grinding wheel, because one, I don't own one, and two, I don't want to overheat the metal. So I'm gonna do it manually by hand just to see if I can do it. Uh, so this is a diamond edged, uh, file that I use for my stone carving stuff and I'm thinking it might be hard enough where I can actually use it on my carbon steel knife here without any weird repercussions or anything like that so I'm going to give that a shot. So first things first I'm going to go ahead and tape up the the edge on it so I don't accidentally cut myself. All right since there's a, a goal in mind I'm not going to make it like a super sharp point of what it was there before. I'm going to do that and so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove everything from this line up that way. I'm going to see if it works. Let's find out if this does anything. Well, I can see it's doing something. It's probably going to be slow going, but I'm going to keep going here. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. It's taking a nice little chunk off there. Probably give me another couple of minutes and I should be all set. Make sure this isn't getting too hot. No, it's not hot at all. And there it goes. Took off that chunk there. Most of it is basically little bits and debris now. So I'm pretty sure this tip is going to look a little, just like how I wanted. Yeah, look at that. So it's no longer a funky U shape on it. And it's kind of a nice little flat edge on the tip there. Uh, what I'm going to do here now is probably just smooth it out. Uh, because I know right now I got a nice little burr going on that side. So I'm going to reshape it here so that it's a little bit smoother. I'm going to refine that edge a little bit more so it's nice and super sharp again. Finer grit and leather strap. Yeah, I think that's that turned out pretty good. Uh, not too bad. It took me about 15 minutes from start to finish, compared to what it what what it looked like originally. So, before I broke it, it looked like on the top. After I uh, fixed it up after the break, it's on the bottom there. So it's a little bit shorter. Um, but still a usable knife now. Now it's probably less likely that this blade will break on me. So there you go. Right. Hope you enjoyed that one. Have a good one.